The number of infants now surviving their abrupt, prompt delivery into this world is growing. This is of course great news, and in particular for the parents. Yet, as usual, there is a fly in the ointment, as this puts an added stress on the already strained healthcare system, where continuous cutbacks are occurring. As the time an infant is hospitalised is based on them gaining the correct amount of weight, the sooner they feed better, the quicker they gain weight, and the earlier they can go home. Of late, a lot of interest and research has been placed on improving premature infancy's feeding skills, which have led to the advances in the use of contingent music in teaching these premature infants to feed. Precisely, this has been studied in a two-year trial in the United States to determine the effects a special pacifier has on strengthening non-nutritive feeding in these infants. This pacifier has a computer chip installed in it, which when used activates a CD player outside of the incubator. This works from the very first suck a baby takes on the pacifier. This causes lullabies to play for 10 seconds, of which it then fades out if not reactivated by the baby. It is through this process of lullabies being played that encourages these infants to learn how to feed and for longer periods of time. In this trial, the timings were varied, with the infant using the pacifier for 15 minutes at different block times prior to feeding, with the objective being to see when would the most opportune time be for learning. Conclusions to this full research are that premature infants can learn to feed quicker and longer and hence gain more weight by using this system half an hour before feeding. Another interesting and essential effect of this research is that if the infant learns to feed earlier and stronger, there is a far higher chance of breastfeeding. This is an important goal for these families not only because of the immunity it provides for the newborn, but also for the bonding process between a mother and her baby.